welcome to my channel. Today we're doing another episode of Jungle Adventures. So, um, in case you missed it last episode, um, we have been marked for death um, by combustion. So, uh, we're trying to find the uh, way to dispel the curse. Oh, well, I mean, I guess there's that. But is there, like, another way? Uh, more choices? Friendly. Oh, ask for antidote. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, silver to Radian. Oh, that's just a poison antidote. But what happens if I chug it? Will that help? <gasps> it looks like it. Look at it. Look at it. Yes! Yes, we figured out how to dispel the curse! Blessings of bones from being a skeleton. Lacey has been blessed with a tra ter temporary transformation into a being of bones. With less worry to worry about while in a skeletal form, she may be able to get a few extra things done. Thank goodness! Oh my god. I did not know that would work. I mean, I guess to be fair, I mean, if you're dead... If you're already dead, I mean, I guess there's nothing really to worry about. Thank God we had bone dust. Alright, well, let's see about getting you a, a shower. What do you need to worry about? Oh, pff, apparently social and fun. That's it. Uh, how about we come over here and talk to this guy? Oh, you need to give your archaeology lecture anyway. And what's going to be so boring about a skeleton telling you all about archaeology? Wait! Fine. Okay, well let's... Let's come over here. And how about we give this guy a uh, archaeology lecture? We'll do a skeleton scare. I want to see that. Everybody's all worried because there's a sack of bones in here. All right, can we give um, give archaeology lecture? There we go. Well, why don't we just uh, do a few of these people? <laughs> Sweet, and we have successfully given our archaeology lecture. Perfect. What does the Roomba sim look like from uh, a skeleton? Very interesting. Alrighty, I think we're going to throw her in the jungle too. Focused academic success from giving a great lecture. Oh, she's got two days to be a friggin' bag of bones? Fantastic. Before it only said 20 hours. Now it's two days. Sweet. She can be a sack of bones for a few days. Alrighty, let's go ahead and uh, travel into the jungle. I mean, since there's hardly anything for us to worry about. Oh, um, hold on. Let's see if the uh, market is open yet. Oh, sweet it is. Alright, come here. Please, there we go. Oh, you... Mm, you W! You You whole bunch of words that I probably should not say. Ugh. Like this guy, Zion. In fact, he's flirty. Let's see. Uh, tell a folklore about the golden... No, we're not telling it a miskin folklore. We have to include a whole bunch of other people. Hell no. Uh, give a pep talk. Brighten day. Uh, discuss fitness techniques. Yeah, learn some fitness from a skeleton. What is this? Dancing. Oh, fair enough. Okay. Um, ask him about his career. 
he is a mixologist at the cantina. Fair enough. Um, how about we, uh, oh, we can't romance while we're a skeleton? Tell an engaging story. That's kind of lame. Apparently nobody wants to hook up with the skeleton. That's super lame. Anyway. Oh, is there somebody? Oh, there's somebody over here now. Whoops. Whoops. There we go. Okay. Okay. We got this. Uh, come over here and buy up this flower. Get a couple more of these. No, we're not going to view the inventory of the table. Maybe buy another liquid rush. I mean, I guess you're not really going to need it, but, uh, because, I mean, you are kind of dead. Ooh, yes! Yes, girl! This is what the stuff I needed. Uh, fire foam, and some more fire foam, and some more fire foam, and some more fire foam. And we'll pick up some more of that, too, while we're here. Uh, get a couple more of these grilled cheese ready to eat. I mean, not that it's really going to matter to her here for the next few days, since she is, in fact, a skeleton. Alright, so we're going to travel on to the jungle. And see if we can find a couple more treasures. <gasps> oh my goodness. <sighs> I was wondering if doing that blessing um, with the relic would end up working. But I don't think it would have. Because I think it says that you're only allowed to have like one at a time. And so essentially we ended up just dispelling the curse. And ended up becoming a skeleton. Oh, there it is. Uh, clear path with machete. Because I got five machetes. Why do I care about machetes anymore? Perfect, and uh, higher fitness skill leads to better results. Do I even have fitness skill? Uh, wave around flower. Oh, and she got a treasure. Oh, she got a frog! Holy crap! And she got a hip to the max cardboard dance floor. Mm, no, we're not keeping that. Is that a skeleton, or is that a, a frog we needed? No. There we go. Travel all the way up here. Go ahead and clear the path with your hands. Or with machete, excuse me. Clear the path with machete. With machete. She can be flirty, but she still can't, like, flirt as a skeleton. Higher archaeology skill leads to better results. Uh, protectively watch the egg. Lacey carries a soft, adorable creature to a safe cave where it bestows a blessing to on her. And from encountering a strange egg, she got a personal blessing. Let's see, that's open. Uh, but we want to go to the temple. What is that? Seriously, like, what is that? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Is that supposed to be like a lizard of some kind? Hold on, let me... Do -do -do. I know how to play this game. It's a freaking iguana, man! Check out the freaking iguana! It's amazing the amount of detail they put into this game. Just like, look at him! He will consume your soul. Alrighty, anyway, we're done looking at the iguana. Uh, although I do need to find out where we're at again. Uh, oh, nope, nope, went too far. That's not the temple. Oh, here's the temple opening. Uh, clear path with machete. Oh, freaking it's bats. Like, you're a skeleton. What does it matter? I'm just saying. And higher handiness skill leads to better results. Uh, we'll disarm the totems. Uh, she walks away with a cool relic as a prize. Sweet. No! Do travel to the temple! <laughs> Wrong button. Uh, 
Alright, hopefully we can like skedaddle through real quick. And since skeletons like don't care about their like uh Alright, let's go ahead and uh, get into the temple here. There we go. Ooh. And examine this. We'll see if this leads to uh, us getting past the temple. Uh, this mechanism will unlock the gate. Sweet. Uh, make an offering to the sun glyph. Perfect. It's so nice when it actually like just lets me go with brew, like. Um some of these triggers won't work. Okay, well there's two other things in here, so examine that one. And some of these won't work, and examine that one. And some of these triggers won't work. Oh, lovely. Okay. Well, let's see. What do we have? That one's got two. That one's got two. And this one's got one. So we'll try this one out real quick. Nope, that's not it. She gained some archaeology skill. Well, that's already maxed out. So pull the left warrior's weapon. Nope, that's not it. She got bone dusted. Well, she's kind of bones, so she I'm sure she could use it. Oh, that's not it either. Oh, we'll go to the arrowhead glyph. Sweet! Alrighty. And we will open this treasure chest. And then we will examine this and examine this. Uh, she got some simoleons and some adventure gear and a mystical relic in her inventory. This mechanism will unlock the gate. Sweet! Oh, I can't even click on the skeleton. I was kind of hoping so, to be honest. We're going to go examine both of these guys. Let's see, what is this blue one? Oh, confidence. From a narrow miss. Some of these triggers won't work. And some of these won't work. Okay, well, let's see. We got one here. Nope, that's not it. She's just having a terrible vacation. Alright, make offerings to the leaves glyph. Sweet! And we'll go ahead and open this one, and then we'll go ahead and open this one. She gained some adventure gear and some simoleons. Ooh, and she got another frog. Now, I don't know if that actually added to our collection or not, so let's take a quick look. Um, artifacts, Amiskin treasures, no, it did not. Ooh, we got a couple more things though, let's see, let's see, oh, oh, cool! We only have four more left to find, so we found a couple more frogs this time around. Sweet! And we found this relic. Okay, we're gonna put that one in there. And we're gonna see what this one does. Undiscovered. No. We are not activating that on ourselves. We have learned our lesson. We are never to activate anything on ourselves ever again. Unless we wanna die. And then I guess that's fine. <laughs> or we could just do dryer lint traps because they are infamous for starting fires. Drink in some water. Some water, water. Alright, you look like the perfect specimen. Um, we're gonna do this one first, because we still haven't figured out what this one does. Activate this on Zion. 
what does it do? Cursed! Lucy has cursed Zion to see the ghostly images of Salvadorati and food. It may not be the most dangerous curse, but it's certainly distracting. <laughs> Alright, put that back in your pocket. Curses of food, food Mirage. We're going to activate this one on Pedro. Where is Pedro? That's not Pedro. That's not Pedro. Is Pedro upstairs? Uh, might be. He's not around here. Uh, nope. So, uh, let's see who is here. Who are you? You're Edith. So let's activate this on Edith. Edith, right there. Where did she go? Cursed. Oh, just another silver Dorati and food curse. Curses of the food mirage. Curses of the food mirage. All right, and then we're gonna fuse this together with. Oh, we know what both of those do. Okay. Well, is that it? I think that might be it for all the relics, anyway. And then I guess. Uh... Yeah, so I guess we'll just come back over here. Maybe collect a couple more things. Yeah, we ran out of showers and waterfalls and a bottle, I think. Didn't we? Yeah. So we'll come over here. We'll buy all of those. Do we have any more bat baits? We do not have any more bat baits. We will get some bat baits. And then, uh, do we have any Dr. Parker's spider repellent? Yeah, we have one. Alright, uh, I wish there was a way we could just, like, buy everything on the table at once. Get one of those, get one, oh, there's a bunch more. Get another one of those, another one of those, and another one of those. And how, oh, we got plenty of that one. And don't need anything from there, and perfect. She seems pretty, uh, full of herself. <laughs> I love the fact that we're a skeleton. I love the fact that we don't have to worry about four of our needs even more. That's like the best part. How much longer is she a skeleton? Six more hours. Okay. Fair enough. Um, and then let's see. Oh, uh, play some world. Because we already chugged our antidote. We don't need the glass anymore. Why do we have a whole bunch of these? We have three of these. We don't need three of these. Um, anything else we can sell? Yeah, because we tried both of these. So I don't think it would really matter. That's the curses of greedy needs. We ran out of crystals. Let's see if we can find uh, some crystals here. We'll do that. Um, I guess it helps if it's not super dark in-game. That'd be nice. Ooh! Ooh, we found a dig spot. Dig that up. Yeah, this is like super hard to see. Oh, we can't go up there? That's lame. Um, is that another dig spot? No. Why can't we go anywhere? This is lame. Lame! Oh, we can co totally come over here and like take some of their food. I mean, not that it matters. I mean, we're a skeleton. We don't need to eat right now. Alrighty! Sweet! Alrighty, so I think we're just gonna head back to our uh, cabin right now and uh, see what else we can do. Oh, stretchy, stretchy. Stretch. <sighs> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, there she is. Yeah, this one's pretty nice. Um, I don't think it comes to the archaeology table, though, does it? No, it doesn't. Dang it. Wait, unless it's upstairs? Uh, no. Dang it, I was hoping so. Oh well, I mean, I guess 
There was always a possibility that it wasn't going to. Uh, but oh, that's not a bookcase. Um, oh, there's a stereo here though. Listen to Latin, I guess. And then dance the Roomba sim. Get your fun back up. Cause I mean, we have to wait for um, we have to wait for the temple to reset itself anyway. So I mean, I guess we might as well just hang out and uh, do a whole lot of nothing. In fact, can I actually get to the temple? Oh no, that's not what I wanted. Uh, can I actually get to the temple from here? Let's see, okay, there's the falls. Oh yeah, it's closed up. And it says... The temple is inaccessible right now as it is my mystically rearranging check back in a day. Okay, fair enough. She should be almost done with being a skeleton. Yeah, she's got still got two hours, but that's it. Is there anything special she can do with herself? Like, no, not those wrong things, you people. Um, no. Oh, there's a bookcase up here. Duh. I guess do push-ups. Um, can we... Oh, can we... Oh, we don't have any parts. She's gonna go back downstairs and dance. And let's see, do we even have any, we don't even have any artifacts. Maybe we need to go out and uh, search for some artifacts then. Ooh, what's this? Uh, harvest this wild black bean bush. And maybe while we're here, oh, is she changing back now? Yep, now she's changed back. All right, so we are going to survey for a dig pile. I mean, it'll at least give us something to do in the meantime. There we go. I was going to say, where on earth is this dig pile that you supposedly found? Oh, there it is. E establish excavation site. I mean, we pretty much have to wait 24 hours before we are able to go back to the temple anyway, so... we still got another, like, 20 to go. I mean, not that we actually need any of these, but... You don't live in the city! For the love of God, woman! What's this one? Woohoo in a bush. Oh yeah, now we have two of those. We don't need any more of those relics. We need the other relics. One unauthenticated thing. Okay, so she's going to go to the bathroom, and then uh, she is hungry. So is there any leftovers in the fridge? <gasps> Ooh, get leftovers. Sweet. This is like the only house I've seen, like over in Silver Dorada, that actually has a bathroom in the house. Not, you have to walk outside, go to the bathroom, and then walk back outside to get back in the house, you know. All right, and then you're going to go to sleep. And we can go some super speed. So hopefully this will help speed us through the uh, fact that she pretty much has to do nothing. So we'll just have her sleep a few times. Since we have to wait anyway, I think it's been at least it's been at least twelve hours. Okay, now go back to sleep. Because there's nothing else we can pretty much do in the meantime. All right, so now I guess she can eat, take a shower, go to the bathroom, and then we can uh, see if the uh, temple is ready. Take a shower, and then get some, nope, nope, get some leftovers. I mean, it should just be just about ready, so. I mean, it said about a day or so, and that was at 1 a.m., so. I mean, since we have to wait a little bit longer anyway, I guess we'll just call and uh, send a text to Sage and chat with him. Maybe chat with Zion. Oh, 
Are you done talking to them? All right, perfect. And let's see. Where is the temple? Where is the temple? Okay, not there. And is it open? Ah, oh, sweet. Uh, can we... Oh, sweet. Jog here. Then you gotta clear the path with a machete. As soon as you get here. Okay, so she's past the falls. I hear there's this great party going down at the nightclub right now. I want to check it out. No. Please don't call me again, Zion. Sweet! Um, high fitness skill leads to better results. Arm self with insulation powder. Lisey sprays the insulation powder in the crazed Sim's face and escapes with her prize. Yes, we're traveling to the temple. I mean, it hasn't been that long since we've been here, so hopefully the temple actually has changed. And it's about time for me to open my window back up. It's getting warm in my office again. Yesterday, it was, like, super cold. Like, we're mid-April, and it felt like it was the middle of winter. Like, it was that cold. Oh, yeah, this is totally a different temple. Oh, this one's got a freaking... This one's got stereos and stuff. Uh, come here and examine this one. And examine this. There's a pool there. There's a stereo. There's all sorts of stuff here, man. And will this activate the temple? No. Well, at least we don't know. There's only one left, so... That's a good thing. Here, we're gonna dig this. Because we need to start finding some more crystals. Alright, we're gonna just reach into this hole here. What's that? Abundant artifact from finding an abandoned artifact. What? Wrong activation. What did she find? Hmm. Fair enough, I guess. I don't know how to pronounce that. Fl flaming odium? Flaming omenium. Flamingonium. There we go. I'm just being, like, dumb. I'm like, alright, whatever. Alright, perfect. Look at that. Just breezing through this temple as soon as we can find out. Okay. Examine here. Put all the walls down. I can't see. Examine. It's really cool, though. Uh, some of these won't work. And will this work? Uh, nope. How many does this one have left? Oh, this one has one. We'll try that one. Ow. I actually heard her say ow. Great, she got a poison dart. Fantastic. And that's not it either. Tell a skeleton pun. Open this treasure chest. Examine. Uh, she gained some adventure gear and a mystical relic. What do I want? Oh! Ooh! She found another plate. Is that the plate we were missing? Probably not. No, I don't care about the crystals. No, it wasn't. We're still missing one plate, but that wasn't it. Well, drat. None of these sugars will unlock the gate. Alright, we'll go examine that one. I mean, that's good to know. At least we know it's not that one. Some of these triggers won't work. And none of them will work. So, cool. That just leaves this one out. So, that one. Oh, cool. It's right there. Open treasure chest. She got another one of those frogs. And did we do it? Do we get any new ones? Ooh, we got one new frog. That's pretty good. Alrighty, so I think we're just going to have to leave this part here. And then uh, 
This way we can kind of give the temple a chance to reset and then we can go get cured of our poison dart. Um, feeling icky. Fair enough. Uh, but I think we're just going to have to leave this part here. So go ahead and leave your feedback, comments, and all your suggestions all on down below. All my social media is in that description box if you want to check all that out. Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to catch more videos just like this one. And make sure you tap that notification bell. This way you make sure you're notified every time I upload. And thanks for watching, guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye. <laughs>